Well, when the wand on your bubble breaker breaks and your kids are no longer able to make bubbles and they are crying because they can no longer break bubbles, well, you can resort to um, a couple of things. You can go buy them a new one, which they're, you know, you can dollar, or you can try to come up with creative ways of how to fix this problem. Number one is I would find myself a little container, maybe a Tupperware or possibly even the same container. But as uh, most females in the house, uh, they happen to have something that becomes very useful under these situations. And uh, here it is. Of course, you women know what this is. Uh, it is, in fact, a tampon. And what do tampons and balloons or, or bubbles have in common? Well, they really don't. But they do uh, have a very useful applicator that you can use. And it'll keep your kids busy uh, long enough for them to make bubbles till they get tired of it. So let me show you how it works. Number one is uh, you're going to want to fill up that container, a little Tupperware container with the liquid, uh, with the bubble juice, uh, for as long as you want to fill it up. I don't know if you want to use all of it or part of it or whatnot. Uh, but the second thing is the uh, tampon. What you're going to want to do is rip it open, like so. And uh, what you're going to want to do is uh, remove the cotton swab. And then you can pull this out. See, they are in two pieces. They are the applicator and this little uh, swab thing. Well, what I like to do is uh, dip that in there. It becomes very handy. And uh, then you blow it. See, it still makes bubbles. It doesn't make them as big as the one, but it does make them. You could even you have them use the other end. It's a little bit bigger. It may have this little thing that looks like a claw or whatnot, but you could still use it, dip it in there, and blow. And uh, that'll give your kids plenty of dew. They won't be crying, and it's something that you may have handy in your house. If you are a female, you know you have them. If you are a man, look for your wife's equipment.